also wondered if it actually might not make the novel stronger. So I decided I'm going to try, even though, quite frankly, I'm scared of getting it wrong and of exposing myself to the very criticism that I've talked about in this lecture. But I think the bottom line is that whatever the color of the character, and whether we're writing from her point of view or not, all we can do is try to make her whole and complex. I've learned that in order to do that, I first have to get, get rid of myself. I have to empty my head of preconceived notions and prejudices about how people different from me think and speak and act. It isn't always easy. Many prejudices are insidious and deep-rooted, and often I don't succeed. If I'm lucky, I catch myself in the editing process and try again. And with each attempt, I get a little closer to empathy, to something beyond race, closer to the goal in Richard Wright's words, to embrace white and black humanity in one sweep of apprehension and tenderness. So, is it possible for a white author to really get inside a black person's psyche and capture his or her voice? I'd like to think it is. But even if that's not the case, even if that's unrealistic, even in the face of intense criticism for getting it wrong, the kind of criticism that Styron and others have faced, it seems important to try. Thank you.